Today's creature of the day is the Sangaripterus. Its name means Jungar Wing, named after the Jungar Basin in China where it was found, and the fact that it had wings. It lived in China and possibly South Korea during the early Cretaceous, around 145 to 100 million years ago. It was a type of pterosaur with a large elongated skull with a low bony crest running down its snout. It also had long, narrow, upcurved jaws, earning it the nickname Flying Tweezers. It had tiny pycno fibers, similar to fur or small feathers. It had a wingspan of 3.5 meters or 11.5 feet, and the front of its jaw was toothless and pointed, used for prying prey from rocks and mud. Its knobbly, flat teeth suggest that it ate mollusks and other hard-shelled organisms. It lived in coastal and freshwater environments and could have been hunted by theropods, larger pterosaurs, or marine reptiles. Sungaripterus went extinct due to a changing ecosystem or competition with other aerial predators. It was described in 1964 by Yang Zanjin, and there's only one known species, Sungaripterus wei. In media, it's appeared in 65, Dino King 3D, Journey to Fire Mountain, Jurassic Park 3, Park Builder, Jurassic World Primal Ops, Jurassic World The Game, Jurassic World Alive, and Jurassic World Evolution 2. Well, that's a really cool Chinese pterosaur and a very unique one. Be sure to like, subscribe, and comment what other creatures I should talk about.